Hey friends, it's Miss Becca with today's book. Today's book is one of our favorite characters, Pete the Cat. And today, he's a firefighter. This is Pete the Cat, Firefighter Pete. We read this when we learned about our community helpers. A firefighter is one of the community helpers. But since it's the month of June and we're reading some of our favorite books, I thought it would be fun to read it again. Ready? We are going on a class trip today, says Principal Nancy. She leads the cl class to a bright yellow bus. Everyone climbs on board. I wonder where we are going, says Pete. They are going to the firehouse today. The bus parks next to the bright red firehouse. Pete and his classmates are excited. The firehouse is huge. It's so big, it can hold two long red fire trucks and all of the firefighters' equipment. The firefighters show the kids around. They give everyone a turn to ring the old brass fire bell outside the firehouse. Then all the kids take turns sliding down the firefighter's pole. Whee! Callie yells as she slides down. The firefighters allow the kids to try on the, their gear. Firefighters wear lots of equipment. First, Pete puts on the heavy black overalls. Then he steps into the tall black boots. A firefighter helps Pete put on the heavy yellow jacket. Finally, they place a hard black helmet on Pete's head. All this gear is very heavy. Pete can barely move. The firefighters allow the kids to explore one of the fire trucks. Callie sits in the driver's seat and she presses the horn. horn. It's so loud the kids cover their ears. Then Pete turns on the sirens and lights. The sirens blare woo -ee, woo -ee, and the lights flash red and yellow. Suddenly, a loud bell rings in the firehouse. Uh-oh, it's the fire alarm. There's a fire in town. Gear up, Pete. The firefighters scramble into their gear very quickly. Pete puts on his gear, too. They all climb aboard the fire truck and turn on the sirens and lights. The fire and firefighter Pete and the firefighters are on their way. up 
Firefighter Pete and another firefighter help Grumpy Toad climb down the ladder carefully. Yay! The fire is out and everyone is safe. The firefighters drive back to the firehouse. They take off all their gear. They pat Pete on the back and say, Good job, Pete! Firefighter Pete helped save the day. Friends, I hope you enjoyed the Firefighter Pete book. I'll see you soon. Bye, friends.